Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. Wait to see how many people want to race on a Saturday morning. It's about what the heck time is it now? Check the clock. It's 20 after 7, basically. 7.18. Something just blew up. Yeah, the, the text there. Somebody was asking, why am I suddenly surrounded by 50 cougars? And I'm like, you mean like, you know, older women? No, no, no. Apparently someone's modding in animals now. That's a new thing? I didn't see it, so. Hey, people are actually racing. That's a good thing. And there's some heavy hitters here. Okay, I can bring my A game. We got some people who obviously have some experience playing here. There are some new people, but they're you know. Hey, listen. If someone if someone's gonna be bringing their A game, it might as well be me here, right? Spinner. All right. I think for spinner, customs are still on. Customs are still on. I think the devastate. Let's bring the devastate out. There we go. The Devastate for stunt races, I mean, I realize it's got, you know, handling flags and things like that, but it doesn't come up so much in the stunt races. And it's got a really nice top speed. I mean, this is really the new X80 Proto kind of thing here. Let's see if that guy wins. It's always my roulette thing. Does, does, the, does the random person selected on the, the screen hate it? It's a non-contact. Good. That means I don't have to worry about ramming into people when I do the turbo uh, launch here. So it's a great technique. Yeah, tap, 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 and then just time that. Time that hit on number one. Now I've got the catch up holding me back there a little bit. Not the mustard, but the catch up. Uh, so, we'll see how that goes. Can I outdrive them enough? Okay, so now he's got the catch up, so we'll see how that goes. Woo! Swoop down. There's no slipstream because we're in a non contact. That was just a better line through there, I think. Plus a little bit of catch up. I think catch up some. Maybe not. What happened behind me? It's like he's gone. Something happened. He, he somehow wrecked it. He flipped it over in the tube? I, I have no idea what happened there. That's a mystery. Dun 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 Oh, and look at this. This is a... Uh, what the heck do they call that race? Where you, it's whoever's in the lead the most and eventually you max out your bar. And the race ends. It's like aggregate racing or something. I, for, I forget what the heck they call it. You never see it. You never do. Well, I, I don't feel too bad bringing the Devastate because somebody else is, uh, is driving one. They, it blew up on them, but... Didn't get a good look at the overall feels. So I don't know if I'm facing... Wagner's or GP1's. You don't really know. The GP1 is pretty, but no, they, didn't, they weren't kind to it as far as performance is Okay, this part here, man, I'm glad that went up straight because I I screw this up periodically, and suddenly somebody's on me. It looks like at least on the map, or is that just an optical delusion there? Because all right, hey, a new fastest personal best, nice. See the devastate, man. It's really I didn't think this car was gonna click with me as well as it does, but. It's a nicely balanced car. I mean, imagine if you're on a city track, you might have trouble. 
because you know you hit those bounces if it starts hopping around. But it hasn't got the, the flags as bad as the Italian GTO. And it's just like a salad spinner, we're going around and around and around we go. Around, around, around we go. Where it stops, nobody knows. Again, I, I got a good lead. If I screw this up once, that's third place, fourth place, fifth place. It's just, you know, you can't... You can't back off, but you have to... have to really play it carefully. Okay, this is significant coming up. If I, I think we're coming up on that big jump. Yeah, this one here, where I think it's the next one where I can screw off a little bit. Whoa, how did he... I've been pulling pretty good laps here. Is that just catch up or is he just pulling that much of a better lap? Because he blew up. Interesting. Interesting stuff. Well, he has to have pulling better laps than I am. He also is teleporting and I don't think that's happening. Move. Oh dear. Oh dear. See? That, that's a choke. Choke city. I don't know why sometimes you just go in a little bit off and the car just goes flying well, like that. Whoop. Looks cool though. But he's got the lead now. I mean, that's just... And he, I had a significant lead. I don't know. That was, He must really... I don't know. Put that one over too quick. Alright, here we go. This is one. This has to go in straight. Straight and up the middle. Do not keep it in the blue. Oh dear, we're screwed. We are screwed. Oh no, this is the truth. All right. I thought that was one where you have the... Hi, right, okay, that was a... Uh... So he got more aggregate points than I did. That's bizarre. That shouldn't have happened that quick. I was leading for a long time. I should have been able to catch up to that and, and still can, you know, compete with him. I was in second place. I led for most of that race. That didn't make any sense. I had the best lap. Wait a minute. If I had the best lap by five seconds, how in heck did he suddenly catch up to me and overtake me? That makes no sense whatsoever. None. I'll play along. Let's see what happens here. He blew up, was nowhere near me, suddenly on me, passes me, and the game suddenly... No, I did... I... Comment in the description if you think if there's a reasonable way this could have happened. But me pulling five seconds a lap faster than he was. Like, I didn't have a really bad lap. My last lap couldn't have been far off from my, my best lap. If we'd gotten to it. I mean, that was... I don't know. Strange, strange stuff. Maybe that was the guy with the Cougars. Alright, so now we got this... Customs Catch-Up Slipstream. Okay, point-to-point -point motorcycles. Um, race type. It looks like it's a normal race type, so it'll have bump ability. What do we want to go with here? Chutaro? Chutaro is my go-to. Race type point to point. Point, two point, two point. What's the point? Do, do, do. So yeah, this has bump ability so far. Custom still on. I think I can pick the Chutaro one way or another. Custom's on or off. I like having the confidence in the turns. I mean, I know you lose stuff on the on the straights. If I wanted to go truly hardcore and I was a completely turbo-skilled motorcycle driver, you go with the body. But, and I do have a body, I think. But, I mean, man, the Shotaro gives you so much confidence. Akuma's another one. That's another dark horse pick. 
because it's got so much acceleration. I haven't driven the Akuma in a while. All right, let's let's do the time warp again. Now let's let's go old school. Let's see how this goes. That's a bunch of old school bikes. So I feel good about my choice. I didn't show Taro. Though. Okay, Akuma out of the. Let's glide this as much as we can. Bang. You know, I don't even I don't even know this track. Have I ever done this track before? This is like not even a little bit familiar. I mean, I'm sure I played it it's just not even a little bit familiar. I mean, it's just something I don't normally pick. Okay, we've got a significant lead here. That was just a complete choke on my part there. I was trying to wheelie and it turned a little bit. I was kind enough to avoid the... Oh! That was interesting. Alright, so I've had a couple chokes. If somebody's coming up on me here, let's get the wheelie going. I don't know if the Akuma is a, as big a wheelie, a wheelie boy as the baddie is, or the, uh... That's a little bit of a glide there, because we don't want to overshoot the checkpoint. I don't know these turns very well, so this is going to be like, I have to be a little conservative. But, so far, I've got a pretty good lead. Not, a, not a, an unbeatable lead. Yeah, I don't know this track at all. Not even a little bit. I don't think any new ones were introduced, right? Not gliding this one. Yeah. I could see where there'd be opportunity to commit suicide on this track. Let's just boop this. This is like not even a little familiar. How many laps do we have on this? Hopefully it's hopefully one, but I don't think so. I think this is gonna be a one lap shootout. Get down on it. We're almost overshooting it. Whoop. We got it. It is a one lap shootout. Woo! So it's a it's a one lap point to point. Okay, yeah, it was a point to point. That's a one lap thing. I forgot it was a P two P. All right, well that was probably my best lap ever because I I don't think I've ever done this before. That's not even a little bit familiar. I don't believe there's still stunt tracks that I haven't raced. Woo! Yes, he's just that's he's turbo sailing it, trying to get some stuff for the montage. Seven differ eight ninety four said heck with this. This is I'm not dealing with. All right, another win for the Akuma. Akuma's a pleasant bike to drive. Has so much acceleration. You know, if you if you mess up a little bit, you can recover quickly. We. But, if I was on the Shotaro, I could have taken all those turns flat out. Would that have given me a better time? I don't know. He said to heck with it. Heck with it! Heck with it! And that was race number 
two. We're gonna go back to the three race format for videos. I think you know it's. I've had this tendency of making these epic, super long videos, and I'm trying to I'm trying to get back to the bite size. Kuma, Let's see total time, fastest lap. I won, obviously it's a point to point, so that would be fastest lap. But okay, what do we want to do? Let's do splits. I like splits. I mean, duel is always a thing. I always like to do duel, but you know, I'm, I've got a theory that the first position there, the upper left, is whatever is on the street. It's whatever people are joining into. And so you have a better chance of picking people up if you go into whatever is in that corner. I don't know if that's true. That's just a theory. A game theory. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not, not associated with you, the game theorist in any way, shape, or form. Although I am a fan. Go Mad Pat. But let's see here now. What are we going to get here? How many people are coming along? Boop, boop. Yes! And our customs... Customs are on. So what do I take here? I'm not taking the the Brioso. I hate the Brioso. It's just... It's too twitchy. So my choices are the Blista or the Rhapsody. If I can take the Blista... The Blista, I usually have really good luck with this. It's a little bit bigger than the Brioso. It's got a little bit heavier... And so if, if, you, if someone tries to spin you, they, they have a tougher time. And it's got the highest top speed in the game, as far as compacts are concerned. So, thank you, Bruffy. And uh, now Bruffy would say, oh, there's, there's no question you take the... See, it's already selected. No question that you take the uh, Brioso. But I find that when I take the Brioso, and maybe this is just me, um, there's at least one turn that I completely spin out of. I mean, every time... I'll be doing every, nothing really particularly wrong. He'll just go wing and just spin me right out into the... Let's see if that guy is going to be the winner. Let's see, is he... Everybody took Brioso. So it's Bro... It is the Brioso... No! Hey, he took it out! A Panto! Nice! Nicely done. Now, I mean, I realized... The, uh, the Briosos have me on handling, except for the fact that they snap spin out. And they have me on accelerations. See, he can take that turn tighter than I can. Certainly the Panto can. But as I get up in the gears... And if we've got good Brioso drivers here, I mean, people who can actually drive them, yeah, they're going to win. Not a question. I just choked that so badly. Ooh, not as badly as that, though. Aha! Another blista. Okay, now it got interesting. And he didn't just choke that last turn, so... Let's see how this pans out. Okay, we should have slipstream, right? Let's see if he can give us a slip. I don't want to bump him. I want to be fair here. Man, I'm a little choky this race. It has been a while since I've driven the Blista. Okay. I thought about just taking a different path there so I could have a clear run. But yeah. I normally take yellow. This is getting close. A little tap of the brakes there. I don't want to bump it. I am drifting down the order, though. Oh, well, you know, dude, there was nothing I could do there. Oh, and he's choked it. Okay, so now we're back up in a fourth. I did not mean to... I'm just, I'm just following my line. He came down into me. There's nothing I could do there. It was just... I wasn't trying to boof you there. I was trying to... But this is a public session. I'm not going to wait. You have to just... But that's... You'll end up in 12. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure I didn't bump him that hard. I'm sure he recovered fine. He's probably right on my tail. Ride the wall. Pop it into gear here. Now, 
Now try to have a, a choke-free laugh. That's what we really want. And I, I acknowledge the Brioso is a much faster car in the overall. If you're good with it. I'm not. I'm not good with the Brioso. I will spin that sucker out. Religiously. These times I'll have to take it down. I have one. It's one of the Mario cars. They did it as a, a Mario red and blue homage. But I love driving the Blister. You know, first of all, it's a car you can only get if you steal it. I think that's one of the, you know, I don't think it's one of the cars they added. If they added the Futo, the Futo used to be a Rob only car. Okay, I guess we're taking red. Stylistically here. Gonna... Chokistically. That's gonna cost me a place that's been out. Hey, it's my buddy. That was a choke, though. Not a good enough choke for choke of the week, but it was definitely a choke. Alrighty then. Still. Ooh, this is close. I'm not gonna be able to overhaul him for, for fourth. Fifth is the best we're going to be able to do. Close, though. That was a close race. I think the Ballista, you know, accorded itself well. Okay, 14th here. Wow, that hasn't even started the DNF timer. So, now it has. Somebody hit... I mean, the Brioso is a pretty car, but see there, yeah, it just snaps around on you. It's got a really light tail. It's just, just, it's a slippy boy. Or girl, I eat Carl's, I guess. Car, Carl, yeah, Carl's. Cars are usually considered to be female, as far as I think even linguistically. But I mean, but it's a brioso as opposed to a briosa, so therefore, I mean, you can tell it would be El Brioso. And Brioso, obviously, the Panto got second. Nicely done, sir. I was not the I was not the best blister driver there, but we were close. That was, you know, he had much better best lap than I did, but we were close in the total. But I I was choking it on that one. There was, there was some chokeability going on there. Might as well get some ammo while we're at it. Okay. Not thinking about what we wanted. All right, they're not picking the upper one. Which one do you want? East Coast or... Okay, we're not even going to get into the vote. We're going to do 45. 45... Okay, I'm bringing the... Uh, bringing the, the big bike, the long bike. The freshly repainted bike, which I might have to repaint again because I'm not sure the color, color scheme's working for me. We'll have to see how it looks lit up. We're bringing the Shotaro. Let's see, is that the second race or the third race? I think that was, is, there, is that the first race? No, in the first race. We did... Where did we? We're going to treat this as race number two. We'll, we'll see that. If this ends up being a four race... Thingy. Well, that's fine too. That's that's close enough for what we would call jazz. No, because we did the Akuma first. We did the Akuma, then the Blistas. This is race number three, and then we'll we'll pop off to another video. Try and keep things. We're going hardcore here. Custom Shotaro. See, now I'm trying to think. Does that work for me? That paint scheme. At least we're running at night, so that's good. We'll get a full dose of the Shotaro paint scheme. Remember, kids, always wear your helmet. Would have been the guy next to him, so if we did that wasn't a true random select. Who's gonna 
What do you think, guys? The, the race yellow here. Or is it dew yellow? I forget which yellow I picked. With the crew chrome uh, finish, I might switch this over to full blue. And with the shirtar, you don't have to lean. You just have to lean forward. You don't have to lean back. You do have to curve boost a little bit because... Whoa, that was weird. Normally I'll get that with a Shotaro. Alright, keep it nice and straight going up to here. No lifting. You don't gotta lift. No lifting. No worries. Just drive. Boosties! I'm always kind of, you know, wondering if I should take the boosts and the jumps here. Not much of a glide, but a little bit of a glide there. Well, we're in the second. Somebody had an issue. Some must have gone, Wee! Maybe he's trying to do stunts for his epic montage. Somebody's coming on me. Well, not coming on you know, I mean, you know, I, I, I thought I heard another engine approaching. That's what I meant. Da 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 da. Okay. Yeah, there, there was. There we go. I heard it. Those are some of the higher top speed bikes. Those are baddies. He, oh, they're going for the turbo. They're going for the, the, the heavy. He almost went off them. And those guys are going to have me on the straights. I mean, I know that. But, like, no lifting. That's a thing. You heard him lift. I didn't. And this track has some precision to it. And I think it will... I, I will perform best on the Shotaro. And here we go. There we go. There was, the, there was the precision going around the slowdown strips. No lift! That's the whole thing. I, just, I did choke a little bit. I lifted just for a, a, a microsecond there. But I was right back on it. But here I'm gonna now here I'm gonna be taking the boost, but I'm still gonna be not closing on them that much because again the other bikes have higher top speed. Someone's popping wheelies behind me, so I, they're, they're gonna overtake me here. They're gonna, there you go. And he's absolutely just turbo gliding the thing. Shotaro's not a big glide bike, it's too long. So he's gonna take me on the straight, but I'm gonna catch him up in the turns. So you can, you can glide a little bit, but not very much. A two, not my personal best, but you can see how how much less speed I've got here on these long straights. But as long as I'm, I'm happy with it as long as I don't do some of the, the, the you know, some chokes on the real technical. Stuff. You can just turn forever in this thing. It just has so much grip. It's got video game grip. Yeah, this is where I'm going to be weak. But up there, you see all that yellow is. That's where it's strong. Where if I was on a bat, there's a chance I'd go off into the bushes. Not saying you would. I'm not saying the baddie is not a much built as See, people are, are way ahead of me at this point. Or are they, are they way behind me? I don't know. There's, that's the, there's first and second up ahead. They're on the same lap. Glide, glide. Oh, we've lost it! We've lost it! See, it's not a glider. Not a good gliding bike. It doesn't It doesn't like that. See, it, was, it, it started to glide and then it pulled it far right. But that's... Any chance of being competitive gone out the window. I choked that. You can't. You don't want to glide with a Shotaro. That might be. That might be. You know, the name of the video. Don't glide with a Shotaro. 
it's not a good plan. Mistakes were made, and they were made on the straightaway, not in the curves. I mean, the curve. This is this is where I'd have it for me. Watch me make a mistake in the curves. It's got so much handling. Yeah, that's a really tight turn. You have to lift a little bit there, but not here. We go through the narrows, just cut the edge on that, avoid the slowdowns, lift a little bit there, just to be on the safe side, I just say, oh, I won't choke here. Now we're into the place where it's not as strong. So I don't think, I don't think we're overhauling third. Not unless there's chokage by someone other than me. Not gliding at this time. Woo! Let's get me a down on it. Get down on it. I get down on it. Yeah, there you go. There's this one. We're, we're just trying to hold on to a top five here. That was pretty close. They were really on top of each other there. I would have been in that if I hadn't decided to try to turbo glide to try to get some advantage. It's not a baddie. Not a baddie. It's not a. Hakachu. I don't think you want to try to glide with a Hakachu drag either. That's a long, long bike. But we got fourth. I can live with fourth. Fourth with a bad choke? Yeah. We can, we can do that. We can live with that. Don't glide your Shotaro like that. It's not a good plan. Unless you're just much better gliding than I am. That's, that's what we'll call this one. Don't glide the Shotaro. You can glide that thing. You can just... Let's see, let's shift the camera here. Woo, yeah, let's get cinematic. Here, and we're back. Twenty-three seconds of of hum. He's not is that a BF four hundred? Now BF four hundred, that would be another good bike to take because that's got some top ends. BF400 is not just a dirt bike. It's not just an off-roader. That's a, that's a good bike. Boom. You finished fourth. Not my best, but hey, we got some cash out of it. Life is good. And on that note, from the Polish cartel... This is your Black Knight. That two Shotaro's one. Look at that. They just didn't choke it as badly as I did. Maybe they can glide. Maybe you can glide. The Shotaro. Well, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.